First tonight, Derek Chauvin now sits in a Minnesota state prison more than 24 hours after a jury found him guilty of killing George Floyd. The former officer is being held in a separate housing unit away from the general population for his own safety. Derek Chauvin taken to prison in handcuffs immediately after his conviction, but sentencing is not set to happen for another eight weeks. But how much does each charge carry and how much time could Chauvin actually serve? So let's break it down for you. The most serious of Chauvin's charges is second degree murder. Sentencing guidelines in Minnesota says second degree murder carries a maximum of 40 years. Third degree murder carries a maximum of 25 years and for second degree manslaughter that max is 10 years. Minnesota legal experts say the max sentences cannot be stacked. And for people with no prior criminal history like Chauvin, Minnesota law uses presumptive sentences. That could amount to less time. But it's all up to the judge who could give him the max of 40 years based on a factor listed in the motion filed by the prosecution. The fight for George Floyd is far from over. These are the officers, the other officers involved are now charged in his death as we know, all charged with aiding and abetting second degree murder and aiding and abetting second degree manslaughter. They are expected to be tried together in August.